I quit the dry fast um, because I was getting kind of like UTI type symptoms when my bladder was like completely, completely in focus, focus, come on, focus. No, not going to focus. There you go. Because uh, I was getting some like UTI type symptoms. So I only dry fasted for like 20 hours. I don't even know if that counts, but it was long enough for my eyes to get like dry. And I woke up with a sore throat today. I don't know if it had, uh, I don't know if it affected my immune system somehow. I mean, I'm sure it was beneficial, whatever it did. But anyway, so I am still water fasting. So I haven't broken my fast fast. Um, and it's going pretty well. I can't complain. I feel great. Um, have a ton of energy. I got a little cold last night, which is pretty normal when you're fasting. Um, and that's it. It's going well. I might go do some yoga later tonight. Uh, or maybe play volleyball. I'm not sure. Maybe I should wait till tomorrow. Um, I don't want to like bonk while I'm, you know, in the middle of the yoga session and stuff. Um, I wanted to take before and after pictures, but I'm in my RV and I don't have mirrors for it. And I left my tripod in Miami. Um, so I don't know whether I'm going to have good pictures or not. Maybe I'll just take, I've got this like one long mirror, but the lighting in that room is like really bad. Um, well, some pictures are better than no pictures, so I'll probably take those. And today's probably a good day to take before photos because my glycogen stores are depleted. So, you know, like it'll actually be more accurate instead of like super exaggerated when you have like, you know, glycogen in your muscles and you look fatter, but you're not actually just fatter. So, um, that's it. I guess I will keep this short. Um, thanks for watching and I'll be back tomorrow to a report on day three.